Dear COVID-19, thank you for your message. You sure know how to make an entrance. I can see why you would jump from wild animal to a host as abundant as us, but it's still hard to believe that we offered ourselves to you so easily. In entering our lives, you held up a mirror to our fractured relationship with the natural world. A wake-up call so loud that our frenetic existence was, for a moment, silenced. A hush punctuated only by the heartbeat of the earth. The pulse of life that surrounds us, even while we're too busy to notice. As we scuttle to our homes like cockroaches from light, penguins, pumas, kangaroos, and boars find room to roam. A tantalizing glimpse of a wilder world, a promise of coexistence, but also of conflict. As you disrupt the mission of our protectors of the natural world, poachers emerge under the cloak of darkness to plunder imperiled wildlife. Loggers, land grabbers, and miners loot pristine forests. As you disproportionately claim the lives of our most marginalized, they who have been denied their rights take to the streets to demand what they have always deserved. Enough is enough. If the future is ours to choose, then I choose people and planet over politics and profit. I choose to restore fractured relationships, rebuild broken systems, rewild hearts, minds, and homes, and hear the heart of our diverse and abundant earth beat louder and stronger every day. No offense, COVID-19, but I'm done with wake up calls. And so I ask my companions in this brave new world to let your voices be heard. What future do you choose?